Are you looking for a leg workout that you can do at home? Today, in this video, I'm gonna go through three exercises for your legs, lunges, so that you can do at home and no equipment or weights are needed. Let's go. In this first exercise, this is going to be a back lunge. I'm gonna go through all the forms so that you can make sure that you do not hurt your knee. No equipment is necessary. However, if you do own weights at home, you wanna be able to pick those up one in each hand. But I'm also gonna show you that you can use a water bottle, you can use a can of spray, you can use a shampoo bottle, anything that will keep you stable when lunging back. So just for fun right now, I'm gonna hold these. What I want you to do is bring your feet together. You can face side or face me, it doesn't matter, so that you can see. First thing is I want you to pull your belly button in. Now everybody, take a look at my shoulders here. I see this a lot. I want you to roll your shoulders back and then you're gonna lunge back and I'm going to go slowly first. So when you step back, this is what I want right here. Make sure that your shoulders are right over your belly button and that this doesn't happen. If you can see this, I'm putting a lot of stress in my knee. This actually hurts me and I'm not engaging my abdominals. So if you want to get two and one, I want you to go backwards. Also take a look at my back heel. You don't want to do with this with your back heel. Lift your heel up and if you start to wobble, good. It actually means that it's working now. Think about surfing and when if you ever see a surfer's body, their abdominals are so strong and that's what we want. So then step forward, step back, and then think about your back knee going to the floor with your back heel high. Again, not this, right here. Wobbly means it's working. I want you to inhale down, exhale up. Inhale down, exhale up. You can do this while watching television. You can do this with your kids. You do, can do this with the whole family. Step back, boom. What I want you to do is do a set of 10, which is really 20. So I'll do one to the left, one to the right, and that is one set. But if you add them together, it's actually 20 lunges and start with that. In the next lunge, we're gonna do the same thing. However, we're gonna step forward. I want you to notice how it will be totally different from stepping forward and stepping back. Okay, so again, I'm gonna pick up whatever I have at home that just kind of keeps me level and balanced, and I'm gonna back up because I'm gonna be stepping forward. Remember the shoulders are back, pull in your belly button and flex your glutes. Now you're gonna step forward, boom. Notice when you step forward, you're gonna to wanna to do this. That's the hard part, right? Boom, center. I'm gonna press down into my heel so that I feel my front hamstring and then press back. Forward, boom. So I have to see how I have to stop myself so I don't go forward, that's the hard part. My back knee is going down into the floor. I press into my front heel and press back, okay? So see how it even throws me off balance? It means it's working, okay? So front, inhale, back step. Front inhale, right in the center, back exhale. Again, do 10 sets which is 20. If you have weak knees and this hurts your knees, don't step back too far. Go up a little bit closer to each other. I have weak knees and I can actually feel it right now starting to ache, so I won't go as far. Now, if you don't go as far though, I don't want this if you don't go as far. Even if you don't step as far as you would, still be in the center, boom, where your belly button is. So here's modified and here's full out. Inhale. Exhale, remember, press down into the front heel when you press away, and you will feel the back of the legs hamstrings, and that's the second lunge. The third exercise that we're gonna do today that you can do with no weights, or again, remember, any weights, they can also be just shampoo bottles. We're gonna face sideways, and we're going to squat and kick back, so it's gonna look like this. We're gonna squat back, and then I want you to kick Boom, lift here. Inhale down. This is a no-no, yes. And then exhale, kick up. If it's hard for you to stay balanced, again, yes, it's working. If it's so easy, you're probably cheating it. Inhale down, roll those shoulders back, and exhale, kick. Inhale down, 
Exhale back, kick back. Again, let's start with 20 sets. And with this, going back to exercise one, two, and three, do the whole round three times. So we're gonna start with the first one, 10 sets. Go to the second one, 10 sets. Go to this third one, inhale, exhale, 10 sets, three times. And then if you feel okay, you can go more rounds or instead of 10 sets, do 12 sets. You can do 15 sets, three times in a row. That should take you about 10 minutes or so and hope that helps and happy lunging. With doing that whole circuit of one, two, three, do that three times a week. Now, if you feel fine with that, then I want you to go every day. Do this every day for at least 10 minutes. You can incorporate the arm workout that we have, the leg workout and the abdominal workout, which should add up into 30 minutes. At least go every other day, three times a week. Again, if you feel good with that, up it. You can go five times a week or every day until you feel really, really good. And then you can always up it from there. Please remember to follow us on Instagram and Facebook at The Fit Factor Studio and online at thefitfactorstudio.com. And we do have a 14 day jumpstart program. We'd love to have you. And until then, remember to live fully.